Why don't we just get the film crew to help? There's hundreds of them. Guys, can we have that? A short while later, the three of us had got the bridge finished. The next morning, the Top Gear crew prepared for the long journey that lay ahead. Hammond, meanwhile, cooked breakfast. See, from a distance, it actually looks quite good. From the back end, look at that! Look at that! This isn't its best side, though, because you've got the hinges on. It looks better from the other side. Right out. Next challenge. <laughs> Specifically, a match between the Grand Tour team and our Colombian fixers. Hammond, with his gammy knee, couldn't play, so made himself our manager. So, we're going to play a five, <coughs> four, four. I doubt it. Five, four, three, five. How many people, five, how many people are two, on our team? It's eight aside. Three. Right, well, we're going to play. Drop the five then. Three, <coughs> four. Three. That's what it just goes around doing this. It's like a mechanical cat. It's a military machine with some white paint on it. It isn't military, it's for clearance and saving lives. Princess Diana had one of these. This <laughs> <laughs> is like watching my daughters get ready in the morning. Am I done? Yeah, you're done. Yours is a brown car. It's not brown. That is brown. Oh, it's yeah, that, it is. It isn't, it's mushroom. The cameramen know about colour. Is it brown? It's brown. It's definitely brown. brown. It's brown. brown. It's mushroom. Stop attacking us. <laughs> get in the car. No, he's got to get in the car. Get in the car. Trunchy. Trunchy. Get in the trunchy. No. <laughs> no, that's the director. That is the director. <laughs> what if I start the engine? Would, he, would that do it? Come on. Come on, in you go. They bow, they bow, don't they? Go in. Get in. Oh, get yes. In. That's the worst stig we've ever had. I guess it is dark. <laughs> film that. Just don't Just film. Don't Let's that. film something over here. Ah, now he's ah. Oh, yes. He's waving his arm at the cameraman. Uh, I think the rest of this film may not look as good as the first bit. I'm in Daytona and I'm wearing shades, so I'm absolutely fine. Butter. With some AA wire and some AA lure pack, Jeremy and I were soon on our way. <coughs> it was brilliant. Thank God for that. We were free, but for the first time, James and I had real problems. Yeah, if you, you want, want to sit up, yeah. sit up. Now you see, that that really says a lot, doesn't it? That <laughs> the only way around this is to get out and complete your journey on foot. Yeah, they're, they're driving away now because they they, they realise. Hello, sorry, panel. <laughs> Nothing to see here. Holidaying in England, even in a motorhome, does make sense. Is that all right? What? What's that? Where is it then? Oh, yeah. Can we get an escort? <laughs> Meanwhile, the three of us, who were the main target for the protesters' anger, this was hopeless, so we had to rope in the camera crew. Three, two, one. Hey! 
Because the ooze was so bad, we had to get even more drastic with the weight shedding. Each team is allowed to get someone from their film crew to help out. And that's a problem for the Germans, because while they have a sound recordist, a cameraman and a director, he is the same man. So their coverage of this race is going to look like this. Mind you, it's not that brilliant for us, because although we have a very large film crew, uh, there was only one volunteer to sit above me, and if I'm honest, it's not the one I would have picked. Still, he is very brave. He once fought a shark. There was only one thing for it. I have no brakes. You've just hit our car. I know, but I haven't got any brakes. They're not pleased about being used as a brake. So I took a leaf out of Hammond's book. Cheers, cheers, cheers. And along with May and half the film crew, joined the party. I'm dressing sharp and I'm acting cool. Got a cheerleader here for the 